This is WBTV News at 5. Oh, Christmas tree. That's the reaction you might have if a mouse or a giant spider might crawl out of your holiday centerpiece. And it does happen more than you think. Consumer reporter Kristen Miranda on your side now with the telltale signs to look for to keep critters out and holiday cheer in. Christmas is when Sheila Triplett goes all out. I'm just a still a child at heart. Santa around every corner, nutcrackers standing at attention, and elves climbing in for a long winter stay. Where do you store all of this stuff? I have a storage room, luckily. Pest expert Dan Capron took a look. Everything is in its place. This is great compared to a lot of a lot of what we see. Each year, Arrow Exterminators gets calls from customers who find rodents, spiders, or other bugs in their home that snuck in with the Christmas tree or decorations like this home near Winston-Salem. See the mouse in the Christmas tree trying to eat the popcorn garland? Keeping him out is as easy as looking for two signs. Holes in it that you didn't remember from last year. Look at the tape. If, if something in the inside is trying to get out, it will leave telltale signs on that tape stuck to it. If you see that, open that box outside. <laughs> Before you bring that fresh-cut Christmas tree in from outdoors, give it a good shake and take a very close look. If it's a real tree, just look at it before you bring it in. Make sure there's not a lot of spider webs and things like that on it. If there are, clean those off outside. A well-kept storage area has kept the holidays pest-free for Sheila. We've never had any problem with uh, bugs and things. This is the only mouse she wants in her house. Kristen Miranda, WBTV, on your side. And preventing this problem begins when you put the decorations away at the end of this Christmas season. Store things tightly sealed in plastic bins if possible and keep boxes just a few inches off the floor so those critters don't try to get in.